it's a UFC light heavyweight division collision. division, a true mixed martial artist at his core, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup. Team. Everyone talked about him being well-rounded. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that can do everything across the board at such a high level. Yeah, he's comfortable wherever the fight goes. Maybe he'll grapple tonight, maybe he'll strike. Makes him a hard guy to prepare for. this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. of everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. More than five years apart, with similar height and the same reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, only professional record on. 35 wins, 16 losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Omaha, Nebraska, Anthony Lionheart Smith. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, 9 losses. He stands 6 feet 2 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of San Luis Obispo, California, presenting the member of the UFC Hall of Fame and the former UFC light heavyweight champion, the Iceman, Chuck Liddell! Okay, guys, protect yourself at all times, obey my command at all times. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. All right, so here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand here. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. The Iceman gets caught with that punch. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh! Good 
right here. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Just over three minutes now to go. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Under three minutes now to go in round one. He's throwing every part of himself. It's hitting big leg kicks. Yes, man! 